beautiful coral reefs lie beneath the sparkling surface of sapphire blue seas. Although they only take up a tiny amount of space in the world's oceans, coral reefs contain more than one quarter of all types of sea creatures and are home to billions of animals and plants. Coral reefs are among the Earth's most precious places, but they are in the grave danger of disappearing forever. What are coral reefs? Coral reefs are the ocean habitats made by the creatures that live inside them. Tiny coral animals called polyps live together in huge numbers known as colonies. They can grow for thousands of years, building reefs that can measure more than 2000 kilometers long. Reefs are home to many animals and plants. Together, the reefs and all the things living in it make up an ecosystem. Coral reefs are some of the most varied ecosystem in the world and are thriving colorful places that burst with life. Zones of the reef Coral reefs can grow so large that it is possible to see them from outer space. Yet it is the only outer parts of a reef that are alive. The parts beneath the surface are dead made up from the billions of stony cups that once housed living coral polyps. The part of a reef that is closer to land is called reef flat. It is difficult for polyps to grow well here because of the effect of the tides, which may leave the coral exposed to air for too long and because the water can become too salty. The reef flat is home to many types of animals that scuttle around between the sea grasses, dig into the soft mud, or stick to the old, dead stony structures. Most corals grow on the sides of the reef that face the sea and wind. This area is known as the Four Reef and it is worn by the ocean currents. The corals here grow upwards and outwards, building up layer over thousands of years. Below the Four Reef is a collection of old coral material that has broken off and fallen to the sea floor. The highest part of the four reef is a crest. The polyps that live here must be able to survive strong waves and winds. The four reef is divided into three parts. At the bottom, plate shaped coral grow where there is a less light. As they grow, they spread out to reach the sunlight. Nearby fan corals are stretched in front of the water currents that flow towards them. In the middle part, larger mound-shaped corals grow and near the crest, long-fingered strong corals such as tacon appear. Further out to sea, a reef develops a buttress zone. Here large spurs or clumps of coral grow, breaking up the waves and absorbing some of their impact before they hit the rest of the reefs. This is the area where sharks and barracudas are most likely to swim. Beyond the buttress zone lies the reef wall, which forms in a deeper part of the sea. Do you believe it? Coral reefs are very slow growers. A reef can grow about 10 cm a year if the conditions are just right. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe for more AWP Marine Science.